are fed up with infractions. Davenport city leaders are cracking down on people who don't take care of their property. That is tonight's top story. City leaders say nuisance and vacant properties impact neighbors and they're tired of repeat offenders when it comes to landlords and homeowners. New penalties are in effect this month for things like not pulling weeds or mowing the lawn. Those fines double. The first offense will cost $100. It's $200 for a second violation, then $500 each after that. Local Forest Air Rahman reports what's driving that change. We were out here about a year ago when this building behind me was abandoned. Neighbors tell me it was bought out a few months ago, but Alderman Ray Ambrose says that there are still too many vacant lots that are not only costing the city, but neighbors as well, and things need to change. This is a problem that everyone on the city council hears probably several times a week. Homes riddled with weeds, overgrown grass, or stagnant trash. We're going to do whatever we can protect the good neighbors. That's when the city sends in workers to keep the community in shape. But those bills add up. This month for weed cutting alone, Davenport is looking at more than $34,000. Ambrose says council members are fed up with citizens who don't cooperate. But when it comes to bad neighbors, nuisance properties, nuisance landlords, and bad tenants, you know, we're going to do everything we can to force them to change or drive them out of our community. Just a few blocks down from one formerly abandoned building, another one sits on West 8th Street. And you never know if there's going to be a fire next door because nobody lives there. Nobody's supervising, taking care of it. Cheryl Phillips lives next door and says she's seen everything from bad tenants to squatters. She says not only is it an eyesore, but could affect her bottom line too. So I do want to sell and move back home. So it really probably decreases my asking price. Now Davenport is doubling down by doubling the penalties. And if they unwilling to address these issues and be a good neighbor, you know, we're going to come down a little harder on them. The steeper penalties are already in effect across Davenport. Alderman Ambrose says that he hopes that will spur more landlords and tenants to act quicker when it comes to maintaining their properties. He says he hopes that will minimize the impact on neighbors in Davenport. Tahir Rahman, Local 4 News.